there's anyone else like me who as soon as the kettle's boiled and the tea's made you have to drink it straight away otherwise it's no good anymore a wig today because my hair looks like a little literal garbage so we're wearing a wig um basically I got bored if you're a creative person you'll know what I mean um I've got tons of projects on the go I've got a cosplay on the go I've got about four or five crochet projects on the go but am I going to finish those before I start something else? No. <laughs> so basically I saw this wool and um, I fell in love. I fell in love. Um, and I was like I have got to make something with this wool. So I got a couple of balls. Hopefully a couple is enough. If not I'll have to go back to my local wool shop and get some more. Um, but basically it's a toss up between a sweater vest and a summer top and when I asked my sister she was like summer top and I'm like yeah but it's acrylic and I'll sweat like a pig but maybe it'll be worth it to look super cute and I don't know I was thinking sweater vest anyway I just nudged you there we go um yeah so <coughs> <coughs> so anyway um this is the wool anyway safari king cole safari chunky and it basically works up like this like I don't know if it's gonna focus it works up like tri tiger stripes almost and the colours are really pretty, these yellows and blues and pinks and greens. So yeah, I think we're going to do the summer top, like my sister said. And then maybe if we start to hate it, or if it's too warm, maybe we'll just turn it into a, into a sweater vest, I don't know. Yeah. Let's do it. So basically, this says uh, six millimeter knitting needles, but obviously we're going to crochet. So we'll try with a six and see what happens. And we'll also try um, a plastic versus a metal hook to see which one I prefer. And we'll just get on with it. Crochet cart is ready to go. I'm ready to go. Let's make something. So I basically made a foundation chain and I made it uh, three inches smaller than my bust measurement and then yeah, I'm just going to basically crochet a rectangle from there. We have a rectangle now that'll go around my chest so what we're gonna do is we're gonna start we're gonna measure a little bit in and then a little bit on, a bit on this side and then we're gonna start bringing it up like that I think 
I think that's the plan. Okay, so this is what we've ended up with. We've got the top piece that goes up a little bit and the straps are gonna go up from there and then I've done a small back rectangle, just measuring it around my body. Um, same length as this, so it's gonna join to this bit and so on and then wrap around and then we'll add the straps but yeah i'm really liking how it's looking so far it's real cute okay so here it is so far um yeah i'm really happy with how it's turning out i think i'm gonna do black a black ribbon band at the bottom and then i'm gonna put inch i'm thinking an inch wide straps like chunky straps and then i'll go around all the edges in black but yeah it's looking really cute like ugh, i'm really happy with it i think it looks good one eternity later are you ready are you ready it's finished are you ready you're not ready look look at it look how cute it is Oh my god, I can't get her over, over how cute it is! Oh my god. I can't wait till it gets warmer and I can wear it! And here she is. Um, I'm really happy with this and how it came out. Um, if I could change anything, I would probably add a bit of a bigger black band to the bottom. Um, I can go back and do that. But yeah, I'm really happy with how it turned out and I think it looks really cute on please excuse my mannequin she is second hand and she has been through some shiz she's barely hanging on I could do with a new one but yeah I think it's really cute let me I mean look at that she's just so cute um yeah I hope you enjoyed um watching me make this I think it turned out really cute <clears throat> let me know in the comments if you thought it turned out really cute or if you hate it you tell me that too um yeah so like share subscribe all that good stuff and i'll see you in the next one